let's get my melanin queen so if you want to see how i created this look and there is a secret surprise so if you watch to the end of this video you will know what the surprise is so this will be a q and a question and answers chit chat with you guys and get through this awesome quick easy fall makeup look let's get into it that's good my melanin queens so like this i'm about to do something i'm about to do something all right so i have here my little notepad and it has some q and a and i'm going to do a q and a with you guys today and it's also autumn so i am going to use some new julia space products that i got recently and you know get into all of this i even have their foundation and you know me have other stuff from them like their blush and highlight so yeah i'm going to get into that and that's just about it for gs place products that i have so you know everything else will be um will be what's the word i'm improvised i'm going to use other brands with the rest of stuff that i will be showing you guys so first question is why did you choose to start youtube I chose to start YouTube after being inspired by Miss Jackie Aina and now Miss Jenny Jenkins. And when I started watching makeup or anything like that, though they were the first few queens who I saw and was doing it. Like the thing was out there and I liked what they were doing. So because of that, I was like, you know, one day I want to do that too. Oops, it took me way longer than I expected because everything I learned I had to teach myself. So editing, doing my makeup, all of that, I am self-taught. So it took me some years to develop the courage to even start. I'm using my Smashbox photo finish um, primer on my face. Now going into my brows. First I'm going to use this um long wear gel liner and then i'm going to use the julia space on top of it the next question how did you get interested in makeup i think i answered that in the last one it was being inspired by some youtubers when i was young when i was in high school and college what's your age oh my age guys let my, i'm almost off the calendar that much i can tell you I, but i'm in my 20s let's just say i'm in my 20s okay So I have to come on here and not do my brows and it's a very terrible thing because it takes me a long time. Are you in a relationship? Oh no I'm not. Um Yes, no I'm not. I'm not in a relationship at this very present moment and why did I just not bless that way to be loved by anybody? Like yeah, just just one of them things here. I have quickly learned that my generation just don't know how to love and don't want to. Especially when a female is this young, when you're in your twenties, both men and women they don't necessarily want to love they want to have fun make it up get all of that good life in and then they think about family and such like that um, for me at this point i'm not considering it <laughs> oh, sorry what do i do for a living i i am a teacher by profession art teacher at that so I am an art teacher by profession 
why do you post insta body pictures i don't post insta body pictures guys i just share what i can when i can and such like that i don't really post insta body pictures anybody see me on instagram i'm never doing that that is not what i do So hopefully this gives me a nice blend you guys because lately I've been liking that brown and this is a lighter brown so hopefully yeah it's also raining and I hope it's not picking up in my feed right now but if so guys I do apologize cleaning up my brows with my plenty for filler foundation in 420 and uh, I'm going to use another The next question I have is, do you have a makeup collection? Yes, I do, and it's growing by the year. I only buy makeup probably once or twice a year, and my collection grows by the year. I do have a makeup collection video, at least the first half of it. The reason the other half is not there is because I lost the footage and since I lost it, I haven't got around to edit and to um, film it again. But once I have done so, you will see. I want to do it before I actually upgrade my collection or my setup because I want to see, I want to document where I started from and where I'm at, you know. I want to have that type of type of um, track history. I'm going to use the Sasha Buttercup Setting Powder. No, I'm not going to use that. I'm going to use the Fenty one. Okay, we're going to be using a lot of black on in this. Hey. Guys, I'm going to use black on powder. I don't know what to expect from the Julia Spurs palette. Yes, I've seen it online, but I've never used it before. So, yeah, girl, yeah, it's my color scheme and what I like to use, but yeah, I don't know what to expect really. Jumping into the palette. Okay, so this is how it looks. Very small. It's a six pan eyeshadow. And it's the bronze rustic palette, and this is how it looks. Ooh, so pretty, guys, right? And it's, let me see. It's the same size as these other palettes from them, and six pan just the same. So, yeah, I have the bronze rustic palette, and I'm going to use it to create a look today very fall with inspired and you know fall inspired type of look and as usual the let space palettes they already do suck a punch I love this burnt orange shade right here. It is so pretty, guys. Very stunning. 
it, it's the color that I'm most excited to try. And so far, it's doing what I want it to do. It's been a good girl. And I'm going to go in with another Business Place palette just to, in my inner tear duct area. I am going in that. This white shade from the Warrior 2 palette. It's very simple, very um, daytime friendly look. is what's the, your favorite thing to do um my favorite thing to do is i like going to the beach let's just say i like going to the beach anywhere with the beach eating food out like that that's my favorite thing to do do you like fashion yes i like fashion but um, I don't dive into it like I would want to because the girl ain't going nowhere right now wearing a whole panorama <laughs> You know this the panorama have people inside the house they can't go out can't go nowhere can't do nothing I you know, like gotta just stay put Especially in Jamaica or government have us on serious serious lockdown It is what it is, girl. I like these two colors together and the white. Hold on. I put back that white within a few minutes. And guys, the palette isn't giving me any kickback like that, so that's a plus. That's a definite plus. So one thing with matte shadows, you have to ensure that it's blended properly in order to and tap on to your lid so in order to look the most pigmented and give you the best results. Yeah. So that is good so far. Let's just blend out the edge like so. 
see under my eye. Uh, that's all right, right? Uh, I wasn't expecting that. <laughs> Anyways, um, but yeah, can't see there isn't much fallout under my eyes or anything like that. And this is how it's looking so far. I'm going to get into the rest of the face. That's me doing my foundation and stuff like that. This foundation is very much yeah, it's like yeah, it's that much. So my next question is with my makeup, what would I do different? Um what I intend to do on YouTube, which is a little bit different. I am here for all the girls, the girls who love and the queens who love makeup, but you don't want all that body dramatic makeup. You just want to do something that you know, hey, I can do this really quick or even if it takes me half an hour or more and get but you want to get into the fun of doing makeup too and you take the time and really get into it. That's what I'm here for. That's queens that I want to help out there because girls, I know what it's like. I know what it's like to want to do your makeup, but to go somewhere you don't always want to run to a makeup artist to do your makeup. You want to be able to help yourself, basically. I get that for I That was my initial thing, reason why I chose to do makeup. I'm going to use my LA Girl Pro Concealer in fun. So the other question is, what would be, what would you say is the number one key to success in your business? I, one thing I can say is consistency does help. I am not a pro at this. Um, this question should not be geared to me in any type of way. Though I have a small business, guys, I am still figuring it out because I'm not a business person. I only know just a bit and my thing is consistency and authenticity so if your clients and everybody who you're making your makeup content for or producing your product to they see that you're genuine and authentic about what you're doing most likely or probably they will support you if not just keep doing what you're doing or change what you're doing depends on what you're doing if you love what you're doing keep doing it if not you're just trying something do something else doesn't hurt to start over. I am going to use the Fenty powder here to set under my eyes and all the places that I want to set. Guys, it's not, not, not like not ultra much. What does a typical day in my life looks like? Work, relax, no in quarantine. Work, relax, 
watch a series or two, edit some YouTube video or not, eat, 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 sleep, create content for work, that type of stuff. It's always, I don't go nowhere, guys. I generally don't go anywhere. So, yeah. That's my life. Work, stay at home, do what I gotta do, tidy up my place. That's it. Your girl ain't doing nothing else. <laughs> It is low key kind of boring until I'm going somewhere, or, yeah, doing something fun. The most part, it is boring. What keeps you going when things get tough? Um, what keeps me going is reminiscing or doing the things that makes me happy. Like if I'm having a bad day or anything like that. I would opt to come on here and do a makeup look and cheer myself up, take some pictures, play some music, get myself into a vibe that I can, you know, give myself a little self love or pep up, you know? Because I may be down in that very moment. Wow. Guys, I'm liking this dirt already. Yo, it's nice. It's nice and flawless, guys. It's flawless. So, th that's the thing that keeps me going. Makeup. Makeup, makeup. It does keep me going. I'm going to try this NYX Sweet Cheeks on my cheeks. Wait, let me put on my bronzer first. So, I'm going to use the Julia Place Bronze bronze the bronze bronzy in dark this is how it looks I'm going to use the bottom shade that's pretty wow i was saying that this probably won't work for me and i was really thinking that this wouldn't work i should have gone to the darkest one. I think the darkest one is so deep something. But this is working. It's so pretty guys. Oh my gosh. Wow. Yeah, sometimes you can't eyeball things pretty good. Now I'm going in with the sweet cheeks in almost almost famous and it's a corner shade and i'm going to put like a few little dots this is the first time i'm trying cheat um cream blush and i'm just spreading it right in my high point oh guys this look beautiful uh, especially this orange this mm. yes sis I'm just putting a little bit more because I'm extra like that oh oh this one leave a mark probably uh, press too hard and if you can see it right there right Hopefully, you see. If I can blend that. Yeah, I think I got it. I think I got it. I'm gonna put blush on top of it anyways, and I'm going to use the Juvia's Place Saharian Volume 1, and I'm going to use Toby and Neil. More of Toby Bohorts here. Yeah. Oh my god. This is so bright and beautiful. All things large and beautiful. All creatures you look great and small. <laughs> yeah, but just look at that. But yeah, I come to my mind. I'm about to turn this down, but anyways, I am now going to 
set this and I'm going to use this amazing beauty rose water setting spray. For highlight, I'm going to use the Julia's Place Zara. Oh, this is my OG OG highlighting shade, guys. Y'all seen this? Are y'all seen this? Like, okay. I'm silly guys when I'm liking my makeup. Forgot to bronze down my nose. Sign for my nose. I'm going to use the top shade to do so. girl liking this look the next question is what keeps oh. um when i look like i am out of some questions but i'm just going to think of some questions on top of my head and see what i can share with you guys How long do I plan on doing this makeup thingy? I plan to do it as long as you guys accept me for But now I'm doing it just for the fun of it. Um, I'm just on here like putting videos out here for about a year or so. So I'm pretty new and why not do it for about five years and then you know be like okay this is not it and then move right on up. That's what I plan to do five years this is not it move right along do i plan to branch out in different aspects of beauty like here and fashion and stuff like that yes i do plan to venture that far but once my editing game gets stronger than what it's currently at i will definitely do that Are you an easygoing person? Yes, I would consider myself to be an easygoing person, but people generally abuse persons like that. Where are you from? I am from Jamaica. I am from Montego Bay, Jamaica. St. James, Jamaica. Yes, that's where I'm from. color is the mauve shade and it's pretty right oh yes says yes this shade is definitely intimidating but when I took it up I was like damn this not gonna fit me Yo, 
this isn't me on a regular this is not me on a regular like ah sis but really and truly this is something that is very simple and you can wear out let me finish up the eyes Put some gold shimmer, you know me, gold shimmer liner, guys. Mm. I said I wasn't gonna go extra with this, but guys, when I'm feeling it. that's what i'm feeling guys that's how simple i'm gonna be and and this is the final look my melanin queens let me just come in a little bit closer and so i am here with another shoulder cleavage and golden goddess feeling feeling myself yeah and the look come together quite nicely with my head wrap and all this golden melanin queen sipping melanin queen type of glowy doingness about me right now i am loving 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 this look guys if you liked this q a and first impressions of using these new Juvia Space products guys definitely leave a comment below and subscribe guys watch another video there right here like why not you're here definitely support this queen um yes oh yes i am here also with a giveaway guys i am going to give one melanin queen this makeup revolution for um palette not this one but yes there is one for a giveaway so so how to win and enter this giveaway basically queens queens All you gotta do is be subscribed to my YouTube channel, guys. Be subscribed. You have to be a um, comment on my videos, share my videos, watch as much as my videos, tag some friends. That's all you gotta do. So comment below, tag some friends, watch a few of my videos, subscribe to my Instagram accounts. I am at Ellie Chanel Artistry and Ellie Chanel Beauty. Ellie Chanel Artistry and Ellie Chanel, guys. Definitely go over there, show some love. I am doing all of this for you. And one lucky Jamaican queen will definitely win this. And the, by the time you see this video of this giveaway will last only for a week. So within the week, which queen can watch as much as my videos, they will definitely win that palette. This palette plus... Some other goodies when you get it you will see it guys i always try to treat my queens thanks for watching again guys thank you so 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 much mm. bye see you in another video watch another video peace